Hi, my name is Wally. This is the first of a series of tutorials designed to help and guide you to better navigate the African Views Framework. Let's begin. Welcome to the African Views Framework. The African Views Framework is also the African Views website. We call it the framework because it provides logistics to the public, private, academia, and independent sector from individuals to organizations on issues that are specific to African communities worldwide. The website is divided into sections. And for this particular tutorial, it's better to divide it into sections so as to help you understand. So the first section we're going to talk about is the header section. This header section is the top section that you've seen here. Uh, here's the logo and here is the slogan for the African Views Framework. That's the Framework for Information, Communication, and Collaboration on African Affairs Worldwide. Right above that, you see the font size, which allows you to make the font bigger or smaller, just in case they are too tiny or too big for you or for your screen. And here's the reset button for that. Right underneath this slogan line is the menu section up here. This allows you to navigate the world news and these are world news that are updated by the minute. Um, you have About Us, event pictures, event calendar, which allows you to create events and uh, post it on the website for others to see and attend your event. We have the team email access for our associates and, and our organization member. We also have the AV store, which allows you to see books that are written by African people worldwide or books that are written on African issues worldwide. You also have the contact us page here. Right below that, you have the search column. Uh, this is a small search box, but it's actually very dynamic. All you need to do is put in two keywords in there and you're able to find documents within the framework. So that concludes it for the top section. Now, um, the side section are divided into two columns. Uh, you have the left column section and the right column section. The left column section, which is this one right here, is composed of the main components of the framework. We call that the core capability components of the African Views framework. The home page here is what we're looking at. This is the initial page that you arrive at once you type in the African Views um, address in the bar. Right underneath that, you have the country profile vital statistics. You have the country profile videos next to that, discourse and debates, research reports, collaborative opportunities, marketplace for authors, radio, which is the African Views Radio, and other musical components that you'll find very interesting, which you can actually listen to while you surf the website. And you have the African Views Television, the AVTV, you have the performance reviews, you have the researcher and decision makers section, as well as the contributors blog. These components here make the core uh, capability of the African Views framework. Right underneath that, you have the African Views business directory. Uh, within that section, you see you have where you can list a business and how you find a business that are focused on um, African uh, interest or that are available to uh, from African community or services providing services to the African community or an African issue or from the African community and so on and so forth. Right underneath that you see the African descent as percentage of population. These are population of Africans in uh, every country. Right underneath that you see the African Views Intelligence Unit. This section here includes our African Views student chapter. This section here uh, provides you access to the information on how to start a student chapter as well as to how to uh, information about a student chapter, what it is and so on and so forth. And then you have the org chart which has information about our organization, about uh, members of our organization. And then you have information directory and then submit a URL as well as work with us. Information directory has information about different directories of important services that are available to the African community or that African communities can take advantage of. Uh, they are mostly non-commercial inserts. 
and everyone can add a or submit a URL that you think is valuable to the growth of the community. To do that, you click on the submit a URL, which allows you to include a URL. Underneath that is how to work with us. And right next to that is the user section. That concludes it for the left column section. The right column section includes uh, the special announcements. And then right underneath that, you see the login or register section. Uh, this is where you put in your username and this is where you put in your password. Should you have forgotten your password, there is a link here for you to click, uh, which reminds you of your password or your username. This is also the same place where you create an account. If you do not, if you're not subscribed yet, I highly recommend that you subscribe because it, um, when you log in with your script, it uh, gives you access to all the services that we facilitate. It does not restrict you in any way uh, in using the framework. Um, right underneath that, we have the Facebook um, script, which allows you to log in with your Facebook account. If you have a Facebook account, all you have to do is just click on the Facebook account and uh, put in your same Facebook problem. What this is good for is it enables you to log in or register with African Views without having to go back to your email and um, validate uh, the subscription. Right underneath this, we have the African Views Worldwide Poll. This is an opinion survey for our members or our subscribers uh, just on any issue that is um, concurrent in the world. Um, we also have right underneath that how many people are online. You can see how many people are online uh, currently. Underneath that, you see the upcoming events. That concludes it for the right column section. The footer section is actually very important. You will see that we have uh, links to some very important documents here. That includes privacy policy, publishing agreements, projects, how to write for AV, feedbacks, how to become, how to volunteer with us, and more importantly, information about the AV framework. If you need to know more about any component of the framework, I highly recommend that you check out the AV framework link here. The middle section here is the welcome information page. And you can see that it provides basic information about our organization. It also quickly gives you an access to the African View student chapter and encourages you to start one in your school or community. We also have two major articles that we feature. One is who can contribute, as well as the question everyone is asking, which is what is African? This concludes the initial introduction to the African Views framework.